Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Raft. It's been five months. <laughs> oh, you loaded in, yay! Wait, remove, oh wait, yeah, don't, don't remove. That's our, uh, that's our anchor. Okay, you've loaded in, I have loaded in. Uh, where we last left off, I think we were about to leave the island, but let's maybe just take a moment to, uh, remind ourselves of, you know, what we have on our raft and what our supplies look like. Right, we we just got our um, metal started, didn't we? Yes, uh, I have a shark face, that's cool. Are we low on planks? I have three. Okay, I yeah. have 16. You have 16, good, okay. Because I seem to remember we had some kind of supply shortage recently and I think it was planks because we were on an island for a really long time. Yes, ah. Oh. Ooh, Beat pick harvest. up metal ingot. <laughs> I'm remembering how to play the game slowly. Yeah, it'll... It's it's how it is when you spend this long <laughs> away from the game. Okay. Uh, I have got that going. Is that cooking? Yeah, it's just hard to see. Cool. Um, I guess we should just get going, right? No yeah, reason to stay. Yeah, let's sit sail. Okay. I have He's raised pushed. the anchor. He's done it. Do we have any specific direction we want to go in? Uh, no, because we don't have the computer that actually tells us yet. Right. Yes. Right now, we just wander. Okay. Uh, wander. Resource pri uh, priorities. Priorities? I can't talk at all today. Uh, our priorities for resources... We finally have metal going. I assume that's probably pretty important. Um, what else do we really need? We always need food. Uh, yes, we do always need food. In fact, that is something I'm going to start. Oh, man. Yeah, we got a lot of plastic. We have a pretty good amount of palm leaves. We, maybe we got to start coming up with like a really proper storage situation, you know, with like labeled things. Yes, I agree. God, oh, do we I'm only have rod. we see. only have one net right now. That feels weird. Normally, I it really spam nets. Me too. Mm, the tree's fully grown, but that's a fruit tree, right? Yes. Mm, game feels a little quiet. I'm gonna turn it up a little. Hold on, is that shark coming? No. Okay, I'm gonna oh, turn oh. it up a little. I don't want to tab it while that thing is coming at us. You know. Yeah, probably not. Probably for There the we go. That sounds nice. I see. I need stone and rope. Okay. I want to start really building up the raft more. But at the same... Ooh, lots of resources coming. I want to build up the raft more, but... Ah, fell in the water. But I don't want to, <laughs> like, waste all of our resources entirely on aesthetic things, you know? Or, like, getting us a whole bunch more... Uh, Getting us a whole bunch more space if we're not going to use it or anything like that. Yes. Oh, it's a palm seed. I don't want to be wasteful if I could be putting the resources into something more practical. But I also would quite like to start making the raft taller. Because I want to <laughs> see how tall you can make it because it would be funny. <laughs> we must... I want to make a really needlessly tall raft and just see what happens. How tall can I make it? Will I it fuck up infinite. its ability to sail? Like, d does it actually get affected by the swaying of the uh, of the water enough that if you're up really high, you'll be swaying too far to stand upright? Who knows? Who, who knows? Saying, Eat a harvest. There's like nothing in front of me that could be harvested. Is it because I'm walking past these? Oh, okay. Oh, yes, that'll do it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Pineapple seed oh. rate. I gotta be on top of water. I forgot water is the thing that, like, is just constantly a bitch. Ah, get here out of here! Is. Oh, God, I'm thirsty. I'm dehydrated. I can't help you. Oh, shit. My guy is, like, almost hungry and thirsty. Right, that's the big thing that I'm always bad about whenever I come back to this game, is uh, being really bad about not keeping up on hunger and thirst. I gotta get on top of it quickly this time. Ah, there we go. I have consumed. Open the thing! We got paper bundle! 
Ooh. <laughs> cool. That's exciting. I love paper bundle, bro. Yeah. That's what I'm always aspiring toward. I wish I was as cool as paper bundle. <laughs> Come on, don't, don't rack on paper bundle. It's got its uses. Okay, do I have a cup of salt water right now? Okay, this is salt water. Just making sure. <laughs> there we go. This is not salt. Where's my buttons? There. <laughs> oh, it's useless. I'm useless right now. There we go. There we go. I got another one going. Oh, plastic. Oh. Oh, I, there's an <laughs> island out there. Is that the one we came uh, from? Or No, it isn't. We're going towards it. Cool. Okay, we got an Excellent. island coming up. Uh, do we have the stuff to make an anchor real quick? Uh, <laughs> that's We'd a good question. Pr probably? It's Anchor. What is it made of? Stones? Anchors. Ropes and stones, yeah. Ropes and stones, and we can do that. Ropes, stones, planks, we can do that. Uh, yeah, easily. You doing that or me? I'll do it. Okay. I'm pretty gifted and talented, so... Yeah, you are yeah, I, basically I the greatest um, bucket with rocks maker I've ever seen. So <laughs> I feel oh, like you're, yeah. I feel like you're more qualified than me to, to handle this one. I think I agree. I'm just no gonna one, put it there for now. No one can make. Uh, is that already full? Place planks. There we go. Uh, nobody can make buckets with rocks like you. No Hold one. On. Is this <laughs> salt water? Okay, yeah. Dump that. <laughs> drink that. Scoop that, put it there. There we go. Pop it, twist it, pull it, <laughs> scoop it. Why do you know what that was? <laughs> You've got what can no excuse. You have no excuse. What can I say? <laughs> that's, uh, that's how I used to sober up back in the day when I would actually. Oh, boils! Back when you used to actually sober up. Now you stay perma drunk. Yo, on God. <laughs> Yo, no, back when I drank, what I is what I meant to say. Um, sober up by playing Bop It? Yeah, I would play Bop It, and then I would see if I, if I was not sober enough, I'd drink water. Ah. Uh, I yeah, thought you were going to say if clever. I wasn't sober enough, I'd drink. Like, it's a drinking game. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's, uh, <laughs> let's rotate this bitch. I've already, you know, gone this far. I may as well keep <laughs> drinking. <laughs> That's a great idea. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, metal oh, ore. Oh, jeez. How, how do I... That's how you repair it, yeah. Always takes me a second to remember how to do that. It's kind of weird. Learning. Yeah, it, when you have the hammer out and you want to repair something, you have to hold down, like, the block type button, and then one of the block types is repair. You would just never guess that. No. You'd think that repairing would be like an alt fire button. Is this that even cooking? A funky yes. Game. Ooh, game funky. Nope. Steer more that way. Here we go. Yeah, we I have a paddle. Almost there. The wind is kind of blowing us the other way, so I'm trying to fight it a little bit. It doesn't look like a big island. I'm coming for you, island. I might be able to just get it stuck on the island without having to drop anchor. We did that once before, but... Mm, we might have to drop anchor. Yeah, the wind is really fighting us on this one. Yeah, no. go for it. Oh god, birds. Oh no, it's okay. It's not the scary type. Alright, yeah, let's go explore. Yeah! I don't remember how to run. That's crouching. Um, ah, I got shift. it. Shift. <laughs> shift. It's not Minecraft mechanics, is what I'm hearing. Now, I'm hoping this place is absolutely full of food. That would be wonderful. I want, like, food and iron and clay? I think we still need clay. Oh, there's a watermelon. Um, I found the crate with some recipes and stuff. Oh, yeah, I have a That's shark head. That's useful. <laughs> Forgot You've got a shark hat too? Oh, yeah, excellent. I think we've killed the shark a few times. I got some glass. That's probably good. It is good. I don't remember what it's used for. A glass, Shit. a hinge, some bolts, a nail. It's metal stuff. I'm very bad at running. 
Vine goo. I don't. I don't think I need red flour very much. I think no. I would rather have simple fish stew recipe. That sounds practical. I agree. A recipe that can be cooked in a pot. Pot. <laughs> I, okay. <Macaron? laughs> when I <laughs> yes, please. Uh, so when I when I hold the cook the the recipe. I literally have the sheet in front of me where it has the icons of it, like 3D, not 3D, like yeah. print, like like stickers on the piece of paper, like not drawn onto it. It's stickers placed they're, onto it. They're actually hovering, yeah. And then my my other arm is just doing the like meme <laughs> soy point thing. <laughs> it's really great. I really want this oh, arm God. and a soy face. <laughs> yes. Hold on, can I just get a... Hold on, how do we get... Okay, face me and stay still. I just... Oh my god, your cold, dead eyes. <laughs> Drop that screenshot button. I can do something funny with a thumbnail of that. Thank you. Here, <laughs> let me... I gotta drop this for you so you can experience this. I must. All right, let me... Uh, uh, for inventory. There, pick up this box here. And box. Uh, then equip it like it's your tool. And you just... <laughs> okay. On my end, you're just pointing. <laughs> you're pointing with your finger through the paper on my end. Yeah, that's what it looks like on my. Oh, uh, when, when you like, look up, you're like float. not. You're not looking anywhere close to where the recipe is. You're just like your head is just drifting off right now. It's so bad from both perspectives. <laughs> I love though that the recipe like. It's like printed out stickers of, oh, Jesus, hungry. Eat some watermelon. It's like smoking. It's like stickers. <laughs> Jesus, that was the shrillest noise in the universe. <laughs> you pop the shit out of your mic. I'm sorry. I'm having it's a okay. great time. It's okay. I, am. I can't believe Discord didn't catch that. Discord I'm usually kidding. auto adjusts that oh. stuff that shrill. The birds got our fucking seeds. Ah, oh, the sharks here. Oh shit! I forgot we have to defend from that. So yeah, fuck you, Sharky. You think we should like hang out in the water a little bit to uh, get clay and whatever? I'm not really seeing any. Fuck! I fell under the water. I may have to go deeper. <laughs> we may have to go deeper. I'm gonna gonna need a, a bigger boat. We're gonna oh. need a bigger raft. There's the uh, there's the shark. I'm gonna steal um, from one of my viewers and say smoking that simple fish stew pack, and yeah. this is the, probably the best thing I've ever heard. <laughs> Holy shit, cooking pot! No, there's so many euphemisms. I, I I was just sitting there for the last like I for the last multiple minutes now. I've been trying to think of like a good weed strain reference to make in reference to like rafts or fish or something I pride myself on being able to pull out the most obscure stupid strain names because they're really funny um, yes I, I can't think of any that have to do with fish now that I think about it it's just that's not really a name you, you do for like for for weed and like they do smelly things like sweet island skunk I can name that but that's not that doesn't live in the water I don't know. Usually they want it to be a little bit more appetizing. Which is funny, because I think yeah. fish is delicious. Cringe. Cringe fish enjoyer. Wow, do you not like fish? I don't. We had this discussion, actually, on you know the what? last we did. game. <laughs> we did. I, see, I, I, I get it confused now, because I, I actually know multiple disgusting fish haters now. And it's crazy to me because I've it's only recently in my life that I've met some. So I'm not used to this anomaly of multiple people not liking fish. Um, beyond my mother, no, of I'm course, who does not like variety. fish. I did know one guy who doesn't like cheese, though, and that's no, that's ludicrous. <laughs> it's ludicrous. And the but worst, you know ludicrous? Yeah, and the craziest <laughs> thing is that ludicrous, he's like, he's the nicest guy in real life. So, like, you can't mm. even hold it against him that he's a cheese hating freak. Because <laughs> like, he's a really, really, like, unbelievably good guy. 
Also, Ludacris's Ludacris. name is Ludacris's name is Callum. Just by the way, my buddy from uh, from high school called Callum. Uh, he he didn't like cheese just ever, and like he liked pizza just without cheese. And he he legitimately it wasn't a meme or anything. The term meme didn't even get popular till late high school for me. He didn't like cheese. But the no. thing is, Callum is one hundred percent perfect human being that never got mad at anybody and no one ever got mad at him and everybody loved him and he was super popular and cool in every single way and everybody loved Callum, that somehow he got away with being a cheese hater. That's it's crazy. Insane. Yeah. That's insanity. Yeah, I can't believe he just, everybody let it slide. Like we gave him shit for it, but it's because we're friends with them. <laughs> uh, yeah, of course, of course. Yeah, I'm we raising sale, we, we don't need to be here anymore. Uh, I'm unforgiving my my homies in the chat who hate cheese. Uh, you yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm tolerant of a lot in this life, but not cheese she haters. Cheese hater, oh, I kill a bird. Hey. Wow, I don't oh, usually hit them. Shark. God damn it, he ate me, and then I fell Wha back. Oh, in the I thought it was attacking. <laughs> I thought it was attacking the raft the moment I turned around to kill something else. Because <laughs> say motherfucker. <laughs> okay, well I got yeah, some dr drumsticks. One. Now we can get that much needed food going. Wow, yeah. that's a really well, we real looking jump drumstick. Watermelons. Look at how the drumstick looks on the fire. Like that actually looks like a raw drumstick. That looks delicious. Yeah, actually, that kind of gets me in the mood for drumsticks. I don't have any. I got chicken me breasts, either. though. I can make something good. I could, uh, well, not really good grilling weather now. I could, uh,. Mm -hmm air fry something. I can marinate some chicken breast and air fry it. That'd be good. Uh, I love chicken. Chicken's great. I also love salmon, but I know we're not going to agree on that one. Yeah, um, El Ripbozo? Is it just the, the fishy taste for you? Texture, taste, the whole lot. The whole vibe. Uh, you can get a really crispy texture out of it, but, uh, if the, the fishy taste bothers you, then uh, for as delicious of salmon, for as as delicious of salmon as I often make, I do occasionally get a little bit of a fishy taste in there, and I don't think I can ever perfect the recipe to the point that I completely take that out. I don't think I can make it fully appetizing. I don't think I could ever make it fully, fully appetizing to uh, a fish hater. Yeah, I'm saying fish haters unite on this one, I think. I guess so. Well, that's something that you and Kate have in common. Actually, I don't know if Kate hates fish specifically. It's shellfish. Anything that's Ugh, like an underwater, yeah. if it's like an underwater bug, she can't do it. See, the only shellfish I can enjoy is prawns. They're oh, shrimp? well, they're delicious. Yeah, over here you'd call mm -hmm. them shrimp, but we know that they're also called prawns here. Good, good. You guys yeah. have knowledge. Yeah, it's not like we don't know that they're also called that. And there's some uh, there's some shrimp you could buy here that would be labeled as prawns, even though it really is the same thing. The strikes. Uh, I keep almost walking through the halls. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like I, I liked that idea when, oh, hibiscus. I liked that idea when we came up with it of like, oh, what if we do this little net in the middle kind of thing? Like maybe that would be more efficient. It would be less likely for the shark to bite the net. And it's true. The shark hasn't bit the net, I think. Um, no. But we also kind of almost fall in it a lot. I always fall through this one. Maybe we could put like a little fence around it so that you oh, could still guy. lean over to grab the stuff, but you can't accidentally fall in it when you're rushing to get something done. You sick son of a bitch. I like it. Yeah, it's a great idea. My brain is so inflated today. Do you need Not a <laughs> you need a drumstick, by the way? No, I don't need a drumstick. OK, because okay. I was going to drop it on the floor and then you could eat it because it's a video <laughs> game and that's just normal in this world. <laughs> <laughs> just drop it on the floor, you know? Ah, fuck. Just how I like my drumsticks. Yeah. That's how you marinate it. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. all that good floor grime. Ain't getting a lot of these. Table. Never heard of it. I, no, I keep going to, like, do all sorts of Minecraft mechanics just to <laughs> play this You've been game, playing that? and it's not... Yeah. Boy, have I. I haven't played Minecraft in 
Man, I don't know how long now, a few years. Since whenever the last time I played it with uh, Bob and AJ and Dan. Yeah, you get the fuck out of here, you swarthy fucker. I just heard your exit come through. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Canada. That Welcome was awesome. Very specifically, like, really, really rural Ontario. <laughs> Hey, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah, it's a little like that, and I'm a nasally guy in general, so. As I've gotten older, I've learned to talk through my mask more, but as soon as I get uh, animated, the nasal really comes out because I have uh, genetic sinus issues. It's from my, uh, my dad's side. Yep, uh, our sinuses just close up and get really, really narrow with time. Uh, my dad got a surgery for it, like, way back in the 80s, I think, where they just, like, fucking drill your nose. Like, Ugh. literally, like, drill in your nose while you're awake. That's how they did it back then. I hope they don't no. still do that, but they probably still do that. That's um, horrendous. But, like, he said it helped him breathe a lot, but then it closed up in, like, a few years, and he never wanted to get it done oh. again because it was such a miserable experience. So he just didn't get it done again. I think I've heard now that you can get, like, a similar surgery done now. Uh, and it doesn't just fucking close up now, but I don't know. I haven't, like, really researched it. I just know, like, um, YouTuber I follow, Pushing Up Roses, I remember her tweeting, like, a decade ago that she got the hole drilled, where they, uh, they drill one between, in, like, the middle bit, so that both nostrils have, like, they can share air. Oh, God. And, uh, that one apparently really helped her breathing. And honestly, that, it sounds like a nightmare procedure, but if I could be knocked out for it, I'm a little bit tempted because like I can only breathe through one side at a time if I can breathe through my nose. That's just how I live my life. And um, every once in a blue moon, I can breathe through both sides. And that gives me the experience of what a normal human is supposed to feel like all the time. And I really want that pretty bad. So like if there's a surgery I only need to do once and I don't need to be awake for it, I think I'd go for it. That sounds worth it. I'm sure it would cost an arm and a leg, though. But then you could breathe. Yeah. And like, if I can breathe better, that just improves my whole quality of life. You get the fuck out of here. I was, I was on that one. And he's still, oh. did you see how fast I got him? And he still broke a piece. He was very hungry. Does he get stronger with time? I don't think so. Hmm. Maybe it's but time to start I... making solid foundation instead. I feel like we get enough planks and and um, plastic that we can afford to spend a little more. Uh, yeah, Here I have go. a decent number of planks. <gasps> Ooh, currently. you see it too? Yeah. Yeah, you <laughs> uh, gave what? me fuck all. The worst is when you run for one of those, you have the satisfaction of grabbing it, and then the horror of realizing your inventory is full and you just chucked all of it back in the water. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I hate that. Uh, Bro, okay. are so good for hydration. They are. Like, a lot of the fruits are. You know what? Speaking of hydration, I'm a little thirsty. That's why I ate some coconuts. I meant IRL. Oh, cringe. <laughs> I should drink my V. I'm normally very good about uh, keeping up on water. Except for lately, because I've been having a protein shake every morning. Okay. I thought it was attacking the yeah. raft. It just kind of went by I... and made some noises. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> he, was, he was trying to join in. He heard you say protein. He was like, yeah, I love protein. Yeah, I'm sure he does. <laughs> He's jacked. <laughs> All he is is protein. Ooh, fresh water. <laughs> Fill with salt water. Him. Cook that shit. So we you really were just saying protein shakes. Yeah, uh, I was, I've was. i been having a protein shake every morning for breakfast just because, like, I've always liked protein shakes, but usually I do it, like, before or after a workout or something. Yeah. Um, but I've realized that for the last, I don't know, few years, I don't really have much of an appetite right when I get up in the morning. And I don't know yeah. why it never came to my mind before, but why don't I just have my shake as my breakfast? And I realized, oh, that goes down really easy every single time and gets me my energy right in the morning. So I've been doing that. But because there's some milk in it and I'm drinking a liquid, it's like my brain forgets that like, oh yeah, I'm drinking all this shit. Uh, so I'm not gonna be thirsty. No, there's only one cup of milk in there. 
I drink three or four cups of water right in the morning normally. It's not the same level of hydration. <laughs> that it is not. Yeah, so I, I can't... Just because I'm drinking that doesn't mean I have to not also be sipping on my water. Which normally I'm good about because it's delicious. I am to hydrate. I was just drinking energy drinks because I'm really healthy and stuff, so... Oh, that's so <clears throat> healthy. Mm -hmm. You can go to Pantera and drink the drink that kills you or whatever. Have Yummy. you heard that thing? Have you heard the new pop culture thing that's happened in the last ten minutes? Pantera. It's uh, apparently apparently in uh, if you go to uh, I sorry I call it Pantera because that's the meme around the house. Uh, Pantera, uh, fucking fuck me! I don't even remember the n real name now. Something bread. Panera. Panera bread. That's what it is. Oh, Pantera. with the, the, the lemonade. The lemonade that kills you. <laughs> I didn't know that was real. Apparently they sell like an energy drink lemonade that has now killed two people. What? Yeah. Oh, shit. Hold on. I got to rotate this bitch. Whoa. You see that? Ooh, There's hello. a raft over there. Let's go for it. Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. Free, oh, you I'm have hungry. a... Do I have a... What's it Can even called? Yeah, do I have Adele? Adele? <laughs> uh, where the fuck is it? Paddle. I don't have a paddle. Adele. Mm, Adele. She did the I... Bond, right? That's the Bond yeah, one? That's, that's the, the only Bond that's, one. that's the only one I know. And I haven't heard it, and I haven't seen the movie. <laughs> Yoink! Did you know that all I do is work? Me too. Wow. It's kind of problematic. You poached it and you never landed on the raft, so it's not despawning. That was incredible. That's in what fact, I'm saying. I think we've locked ourselves in place by going up against <laughs> it. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Goodbye. I think we just found an accidental anchor. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. All right, sweet. So, did you get anything good? No. I got scrap. Lame. Yeah. It's better than nothing. At least it's like some kind of metal. Yeah. Okay. Um, should we... Well, what's priorities? I feel like the raft needs to be a bit bigger. I feel like we need to organize it better. I feel like we probably need to have like a, a bit of a stockpile of water. Is there a way to do that? Because we're often scrambling for it. Yes, they are bigger. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Oh shit, I didn't even hear it that time. Nice. Fuck you! Okay, anyway. So, um, there is... I check out food. There are water bottles, which can be filled with more water. Actually, if I just get more uh, vine goo, I can make those. Oh, uh, I have one vine goo. Uh, I will oh, throw I have tons it at of you. Seaweed. Oh, there is God. now vine goo on the ground. Make sure to throw it directly in the water. Floor goo. There we go. Come on. Yoink. Let it cook. Raw potato. That is mm. nice. I can do something with that. I need to eat. I need to consume. And I will in time. There is some cooked mackerel on the grill. Thanks to all my hard work. Oh, I don't even need to water that? Oh, it just started raining and the animation didn't start yet. Okay. Ah, I see. I, I picked up the fresh water to water this uh, potato I just planted. And it just didn't tell me to water it. Oh. I um, guess... Um, oh, okay. I guess when weather changes, the... Uh, ooh, fine goo. I guess the uh, when the weather changes... Oh, get out of here. When the weather changes, the effects of the weather happen before the visual effect happens. So yes. the plants become watered before the rain actually starts. <laughs> Weird. That sounds like a philosophical like quote someone would say that like uh, I almost said Chun Li, like that's a famous philosopher <laughs> yeah. in famous Street Chinese Fighter philosopher <laughs> Chun Li. <laughs> Sorry about that, Chun Li. I wouldn't even accuse you of being a philosophy <laughs> famous, major. Famous Chinese philosopher <laughs> Lu Bu. <laughs> Just naming the coolest Chinese person you could think of. <laughs> oh my god. 
Famous Chinese philosopher Jackie Chan once said, "You know, no, actually, that man is a philosopher. Don't, don't even argue that with me." I loved his cartoon growing up, and I loved his movies growing up, and then I learned that he's a turbo asshole about like his daughter and his son yep. or some. He's got like some weird relationships, and it's also like said a whole bunch of weirdly really pro-China stuff for like a Hong Kong dude, and I don't know, a lot of weirdness. Okay, so this is partially filled with fresh water. I'm gonna keep filling it. Oh, what is? The strength bottle I made. Oh, I didn't it's, know you could uh, partially fill something. It's called Cool Drink. Ooh. Oh yeah. It's called Cool Spot on the SNES. <laughs> That's such a specific <laughs> reference. <laughs> Do you know that game? No! <laughs> you shouldn't. It's okay. <laughs> I don't even have that game or the console it was on. Oh, I had an ECNES. I had a Genesis. Or a Mega Drive oh, I in had some a Mega countries. Drive. Yes. There, there you go. I had yes. one too. It's a really good console. I don't care what it anyone is. says, the music on it was really good. Sonic Mega Collection Plus. I did not have Sonic Mega Collection Plus, <laughs> although I did have some of the Sonic collections on GameCube which had a bunch of those games. On, on the Mega Drive, though, I did have Sonic 2, and I played Ooh. a lot of Sonic 3 at a friend's house, and both of those were really good. I just love Sonic. Well, I used to uh, play it all the time, and now they keep coming out with bad games. <laughs> now, hold on. So <laughs> hold on. Every <laughs> single human on Earth has a, has a different date when they say that the bad games started coming out. Sonic and I'm all, Boom. I'm always interested on where people draw that line, because that line could be drawn <laughs> anywhere, man. <laughs> like, Sonic Boom. And I will I will fight to the death about Shadow the Hedgehog. That was a masterpiece. Okay, I, have you ever seen my Let's Play of, of Shadow the Hedgehog? No. I believe it's the shortest Let's Play I've ever done, because you can beat that game in like 45 minutes. Hell yeah, you can. I did the pure neutral ending, because to this day, I the only reason we Let's Played the game is because I, I got that game growing up, and I remembered the pure neutral ending being the funniest fucking thing in the world. Do you remember <laughs> what it is? No. The pure neutral ending of Shadow the Hedgehog is you team up with Dr. Robotnik and roboticize the entire world, ending all suffering by turning everybody into a soul in a robot body who's completely mindless. Uh, uh, my my, my so, thing's broken. No. Ah! Ah! So the, uh, the, the pure neutral ending of that video game is the bad ending of every previous Sonic game. <laughs> <laughs> and then oh it just pl and it plays it out in the credits like you did something like ambivalent and neutral, and it's like you just killed all life on Earth and replaced it with robots. That's exactly what I expect out of Shadow the Hedgehog. If I'm being fair, that's nuts! <laughs> what an absolutely ludicrous neutral ending, and you can get it in like. 45 minutes by sprinting through every stage and not doing the objectives. It's really funny. So I it's, did that. Oh. It was a three episode let's play. Episode one and two is the story mode and then episode three was just me and Brandon playing the um, playing the multiplayer which is just Shadow the Hedgehog and recolored Shadow the Hedgehogs shooting each other with guns. Yeah! That's what I like <laughs> about Shadow the Hedgehog. Guns! It's so, it's so fucking stupid but I kind of love it. Oh, hold Mm -hmm. We can go over there. That's really close. Oh, do we not have a uh, anchor? Ship. Uh, oh, no, not right now. Yeah, I'm really bad about forgetting to remake the anchor. Me too. I'll do it this I time. I just learned. Oh, thanks, man. I got your back. <laughs> you, got, you know, if anyone's got me, I know Madrat's got me. Yeah, that's what you all often say, you know? When you're yeah. feeling down and you feel like you don't know what's going on in your life, you're like, MDB's got me, though. MDB. Yeah, and that's what I call you. I call you by your stage name. Everybody calls me by my stage name. I have, like, family that calls me that. It's been... That's the thing is, it was my name before it was my stage name. MDB's just, was a nickname in high school. It, was, it really? wasn't my username. Like, my, my original username on YouTube is not Madrybred. It's Madrot56... It's uh, Madrot567, because that was my username, because I was just a viewer. 
I That's got on funny. YouTube when it was new. That's amazing. Yeah, MDB, that was my nickname in high school. It, like- Yo, literally! Yeah, like that- that's literally just what people called me, is MDB or Madrai. That's what the teachers called me, too. That's like, funny. I got, like, two people in my life that called me Madra. To me, my name is MDB. Your name is Mimsy, and you can't change my mind. I'm a nickname giver. Yeah, I'm Mimsy. Duh. Mimsy. I've been saying it oh the whole God. time. <laughs> You're the Mimsy. Duh. <laughs> Billy Eilish joke. I'm so sorry. I don't. That's. that's the I've ever seen. Oh, that's the that's the kid with the sweater and the hair. The sweater and the hair. Yeah. Yeah, the kid that looks sad. That one. Which one? <laughs> you know. <laughs> okay, but Billie Eilish does look sad, <laughs> right? Sad, I'm right? yeah, she does. She's okay. Sad looking. Just making sure that I'm talking about the right person. Is it is it bad that I can say, oh, the sad one with the sweater and the long hair, and you know that I'm right? Yeah. <laughs> this is my pop culture knowledge at 31. You're still younger than my oldest sister, and that's really funny to me. Why, is she more uh, pop culture literate? Uh, no, no, oh, okay. absolutely not. She's thirty-two. Okay. Um, she's my youngest, oldest. Does that make sense? Yeah, it does. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So you got a really big age gap in the in, of the siblings, then. Yeah. So she's nine years my senior. My other sisters are um, eleven and twelve years older. Previous marriage kind of thing. Yes. Ooh, hold on. I see some scrap. Yoink. Gotta get that oh, fuck. Uh, Try not to die, I think, is uh, my... That's okay. I had full health. Okay, um, well, that's fine, then. Do we want to keep getting more of this stuff, or do we not care about it? Your call. Uh, I think more scrap's a good idea, because a lot that we're going to need soon is nails and uh, hinges. I don't remember if they're both made from... I know nails are, but... Um, Adrian scrap. Nails... From 2014. Uh, get out of here. I think I hit it. Did it die? No. Okay. Man. I, I was sorry. I was trying to pull stupid, obscure wrestling jobber references out of the recesses of my mind. And then a bird tried to eat my food. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So what we need to do is we need to um, find a bigger oh okay i need to make an empty bottle okay 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 oh die oh fuck it i hardly nah. know her all the more reason to no <laughs> strings attached <laughs> the uh the gaming <laughs> guild tm uh has been making that joke all year the i hardly know her to everything everything uh, oh, it's <laughs> yeah. okay I make that joke around the house. It's okay. <laughs> As you should. Everybody should. To your cats? Yes. <laughs> you can't prove they don't. <laughs> I said to your cats, but yeah, no, oh. I'm just a yeah, I, no, I interpreted that as them the saying it too. Yeah. Sabu walking around the house, and I hardly know her. <laughs> Yeah, well, they do. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> what I'm saying in a roundabout okay. way is that my cats routinely make out-of-date jokes. What I'm trying to say is my cats hardly know her. Yeah. <laughs> Such a stupid joke. Should we make some fish bait and keep collecting more stuff? Or, because um, I, I don't see any more scrap. I collected a little yeah. bit more, but I'm not seeing any more. I'd say it's not worth it now, but uh, when we're at a bigger island, we should do that. Speaking of, we need to get, that's what I was going to say before, we need to get to a bigger island so we can get more recipes for the computer so that we know where we're going. Sure. Uh, want me to uh, raise the anchor? Raise anchor! Away! Okay. <laughs> All right, we're moving. I'm just like a ship captain. What I'm going to be, uh... I'm gonna be responsible this time, and I'm gonna preemptively make our next anchor. Whoa! There we go. We've already got a new anchor. Perfect. We got a smart guy over here. Yeah, look at this. Me being responsible or something. What's that all about? Ew. That's cringe. 
Maybe I have. Okay. okay. Another empty bottle made. And I would give this to you, but I actually need to research it. I want to start really expanding the raft. Oxygen bottle. Yeah, awesome. you can swim for longer. That sounds really useful. Mm, we're chasing that raft. Oh, you said you got glass, right? Yes, I have one glass in my inventory and there might be some in, whoops, and there might be some in one of those chests. I don't think there is. Can I? You want sure. Oh God. Here oh go. God, the thing's glitching. There we go. We're good. We're good. <laughs> we're fine. Ah! Well, Get out of here. Hit it. I, I did hit it. I saw red too. It didn't die though. I guess they're not always a one shot. I want those drumsticks. It's easy, good food. Drinking glass. Okay, so Binoculars. now we can make advanced purifiers, which purify several cups of water at once. Oh, thank uh, we God. need four glass. Four glass. Um, I'm guessing which we make sand, glass I with think. sand. I have some sand on me. I will Chuck put that in here. In there. Yes. Yes, we're advancing. Okay, finally. I feel like food and water has been rough. It, it occupies a lot of our time constantly having to take little breaks to get food and water going. Yes, I also think we should aim for a bit more clay so that we can make another smelter. I believe I just collected some. I have one clay on me. It's not much. Smelter? Oh no, I can't bring that to mm. here. I can't do it. I can't. Why can't do you? It. You already everybody <laughs> auto completed the joke in their head. <laughs> <laughs> My friends are going to watch this and be so angry at me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, are they going to watch? Well, you know what? You know what's fucking crazy to me, okay? So there's like a five-month gap between the first recording session and this one, right? Actually, no, not yeah. even because the first recording session was entirely scrapped because the audio was fucked. So there's an even yeah. bigger gap. It's probably been a year. <laughs> so, oh, fuck me. Honestly, it probably has because there was a sizable gap between the failed session and the first session that went up. But... Even though I have never aired it, like up to this point, that raft episode still hasn't aired. I just have it unlisted in the playlists for people to find and watch early if they want to. Um, over a thousand people have watched it. Wow. Which is the most of any unlisted series I've ever done. So I am amazing. Yeah. <laughs> that is all me. The people like you. It works. <laughs> Well, I did advertise it to my friends, but we kind of sat down and watched it. And you it got like a, a thousand of them. Oh, that's no, awesome. No, a thousand friends. Oh, fuck me. Oh, <laughs> shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, I got it. Okay, we good. Yay. Don't <laughs> oh, drown. Shit. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're good. I got a glass. Oh, that's really. Oh, you mean the glass from here or the glass from no, the. No, no, no. I now have got two. Oh, shit. That was so lucky. Yeah. Okay, but do no, we have any sand? My friends watch uh, our, our two episodes, and we're like, that's cool. And, you know, I tr keep trying to say, watch them again. And they're like, yeah. See, <laughs> but, I you know. that's all the more incentive <laughs> for me to start talking about wrestling so I can inflict it upon them. Yes. We kind of, several of us kind of happened to like, well, you know, several of them happened to like it before I started uh, enjoying Good. it because you Good. forced it. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely forced fed it to you until you realized it's <laughs> awesome. Yes, exactly. That's how it, it was. Maybe every episode we need to friends. pick a wrestler and I can just start telling you all the storylines I can remember of them because 95% of them are probably fucking ludicrous. I fucking love ludicrous. <laughs> He's awesome. Yeah, I know, but he hates cheese. <laughs> it's so weird. It's so strange. <laughs> I can't get over it. But it's everyone's just, just okay with abominable. it. Like it's like they it's like they don't even care about the truth. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> so fucking stupid. Uh, I like this joke. <laughs> it's fucking oh yeah, awesome. I got I got seven scrapped by the way. I I just put it away. Um oh, good, yeah. Scrap, can we like melt that down or something? We turn it into but I don't think we can melt it down unless they change right. something in the updates. I think you're unless right. That. Whoa. Oh, right. I should be planting a potato. <laughs> That's crazy. I was just thinking I should be planting my potatoes. Oh, but my like, God. Out of game. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, you do have a nice garden. 
Yeah, but I can't plant them yet because I haven't got my pots filled with soil because I'm poor. It's always a problem of not having enough pots. See, this is why legalization is <laughs> important. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> Such a stupid show. All of these jokes have been fucking stupid. That's what the show's all about. Yeah. Quite literally, though, if you go in the mission statement on the channel, that's that's what it says. <laughs> he had a smoke pot. <laughs> uh, <because laughs> that is not exactly what it says. <laughs> he had a smoke pot and kick ass, and I'm all out of ass. <laughs> I think the mission statement is um, <laughs> to make you feel like you're hanging out with your friends, but all your friends are idiots. Uh, so far, I've been told everyone who's ever brought up my mission statement has told mm -hmm. me that we nailed it. So I'm pretty proud. Good. Excellent. <laughs> okay, I really want to expand the raft. I'm just worried about eating up all of the wood supply. Do you think we have, we have enough? Out Can we afford to start like really using up the wood and um, plastic too? I think for expanding so. flo flo uh, floor space, takes a um, lot of plastic. The only thing is, as long as we keep six plastic, I'll just nab six plastic and keep the wood that I have and then go for gold. Sure. I, I think we'll... Inventory. I think no matter what, we're going to run out of planks before we run out of plastic. I think planks are just a higher use item. Good lord. Yes. Like, yeah, I have six planks on me and that's it. <laughs> the chests don't have anything. Oh, wait, really? Yeah. Oh. I felt like we had, like... 30 not long ago, but you'd blow through planks to cook things so quickly. Yeah, I just put in the chest I'm in now 20 planks, so Thank you. enjoy those. I'm not going to use up, like, all of them too quick because, again, we got to refuel fires and stuff. What the fuck is going on? I can't, uh... This. I can't get out of the thing. Yep. Is this a glitch? Yep. Yeah, it is. It's, it's been... It's been... Is, it takes is, me a while sometimes. It's a connection thing, I think. Oh, okay. It's not letting me leave my inventory menu. <laughs> yep. Wait, how is it a connection thing, though? I hear you perfectly fine on Discord. Oh, my guy's got to, getting hungry. I need to eat, but it won't let me switch items and eat. But I'm getting hungry. Yeah, that's that's the best part of the oh video my God. game. I, I'm hitting escape to, like, bring the menu up to save, and nothing's coming up. Yeah. Hit the what? raft developers up with this. Have we had this? Have you ever had this glitch before? Because I haven't. Yes, yes. Is this a common um, one? Uh, well, Dylan and I were trying to play it before we started recording for the first time, um, and it would happen I, to us all the time. I, I can't. I can't fight that. I hear something yeah. going on. I can't. I can't even turn around. I know. What do I do? How do you fix this? Uh, man, I've just been spamming escape, and it worked eventually. Really? Yeah. It's Dude, rough out here, man. I, I'm spamming escape too, but, like, nothing. Do I, like, I'm, like, really far away from the chest, and I don't want to fall in the water, you know? But I'm going to starve. Yeah. Do I just, like, force close the game? But I didn't, does the game autosave? I think it does. I guess I'm force closing. Yeah. Ooh, the that's scary. scary. Oh, that's really scary. All right, everybody. <sighs> I'm booting the game back up. Are we going to have lost a significant amount of progress? God, I've never seen that before. That's awful. Yeah, it came with a new update, and I don't know if they are working on it. <laughs> How new is the update? A few months. Probably uh, almost a year. Yeah. Oh god, that's scary. Okay, well I'm I'm booting the game. Oh yeah. Oh god, come on, software. Can you see the video game, please? Thank you. There we go. Okay, everybody, you're seeing in real time. Did we just lose all of our progress today? Because we've been going for 50 minutes. Oh, that's a beautiful raft someone made here. It's like a floating gazebo. Oh, well, that looks really nice. Bro, bro. Load world. I'm gonna world tell you something indeed. that you're gonna laugh at. What? Which will now allow artistic nudity following the viral topless. Oh, era. yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually yeah. tweeted about that earlier. <laughs> um, okay. Look, at least they made it so that um, 
the big change was they more explicitly allow essentially just nudity and uh, VTuber nudity, but oh. uh, stuff tagged as, as sexual and 18 plus will no longer show up on the part of homepage that has a thumbnail. Good. <laughs> oh no. Is this the island we started the whole episode on? You're kidding me. I don't know. Hold on. Is it? Uh, you can it's join in now. To auto save. Join it. We're on. Uh, yeah, an, we're we're at an island. I don't know if this is that island. I don't. Oh I, sweet, uh, but it, it, it might be. I have one sand in my inventory. I remember digging here. I think. Hold on. No, no, no. This is the island where we were getting scrap. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Maybe cool, we cool, lost cool. ten minutes. That's not that bad. That's nothing. Whoo! I'm gonna be manually saving habitually from now on. God. That's right. the Pokemon Let's Player game. Man. Yeah, I still have a full bottle of water. Cool. Okay, uh, I'm gonna grab that sand now that we know that we really need the glass. Yes, yeah. Oh, does that mean I haven't researched it yet? Or have I? I have. Okay, cool. Metal ore right under the raft. You know what? There's a lot of good shit right under the raft we can pick up. Come here, Sharky. Come on. Come on, okay. you piece I of shit. Got a few good things, but took a few hits. <laughs> <laughs> you engaged the wrath of the shark. Okay. 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 Yeah, I'm only two wood behind. Ooh. We're good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, that was nerve-wracking. When I loaded in and I saw this island, I was like, oh god, don't tell me it's the one from the start. Yeah. I thought it was. Okay, so we, we missed out on one raft that you collected, I think, and I I think if I remember right, the only good thing it had was a piece of glass. Yes. Okay. I do have a piece of glass um, on me. I have a piece of sand on me and I put the other sand in the thing to cook. If we can find one more sand or glass, then that would be four. What did we need four for again? Was that like the the distillery thingy? Water purifier? Water purifier. Man, Which you know I what that makes me think of? This again. Do you know the game Wayward? Yes, vaguely. Um, I haven't played it in a while, and I know the game has updated a lot since the last time I played it, but I gotta play that one again. And I, I hear it's got, like, full multiplayer now that apparently is really good. But, like, when I played it last, it was like a, like a turn-based survival thingy. Like, like every, like, old, old PC RPG style where every time you move, Ooh. a unit of time goes by, and so everything else moves. Wow, that's cool. Yeah, but there's also like a real time mode where I guess it moves on like a timer or a ticker or something so that it works multiplayer, which is crazy because like I remember when I heard they were working on multiplayer for it, I was like, how? The game is entirely like turn based, essentially, because things only move when you move. Um, so how would you do multiplayer? But they found a way to get a real time mode in it that apparently works really well. I've never played that mode, though. Five plastic, two copper ingot, one vine goo, and we can make a circuit board. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, we're advancing. I'll take some plastic. That's my plastic now. Copper okay, ingot, so I need to smelt back up. these copper and vine goo, which I've already got ready to start smelting after you're done with your <laughs> Sorry, flies. I just you're threw okay. that in. <laughs> You're okay. It's okay. That sounds too much like some people around here. <laughs> I'm. I've been practicing a lot with my accents because I, you know, I do the dungeoning and dragoning sometimes. Yeah, yeah. On occasion, um, you've dungeoned okay. some dragons. <laughs> I, sure, I sure have. I play like three or four times a week, depending on. Jeez. When it is, yeah. Uh, I run two games, one on Monday, one on Saturday, uh, every other Saturday. Um, I don't know how you so stay I've this been... busy. It's crazy. Oh, there's it's the raft. It's not good for my health. I, oh. We could literally go get that right now if you wanted to. Why not? All right, let's do it. It's to the sails. We're oh, already yay. almost pointed that way. There we go. 
It knew what we wanted. Okay, I need to make a new anchor. I can't forget. There we go. Um, you have, uh, f at the moment at least, you can take all of the fresh water when you need to. Ah! Hey, motherfucker. I watched Thank him do that you. in real time. I, I can hold a lot of water in this water bottle. Good. I can Idiot. hold one drink worth. Do you drink um, enough water in the day? No. Wow. I know. I, uh, How dare. Mm, here's the problem, right? Our tap water tastes like fucking dirt. Uh, oh, yeah, same here. It's okay. I don't yeah. use the tap. We use so a bread of water filter. filter. I would. Yeah, see, I need one of those. But I yeah, yeah. also have... Um, I had some of my money stolen. I need to contact the bank. Fuck! Mm. <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, that's top priority right there. Um, but that is really frustrating, and I'm almost inclined to wait until after Christmas. Because if I have to get a new card, it won't be here till after Christmas, and I haven't done any Christmas shopping. So, like... I know, want to collect life. that thing. Collect, collect that thing. thing, please get into range, please! Yes. It came to me. That was perfect. He's done it. Oh my god, that was a lot of things, including glass. Nice. Okay. Oh, uh, wait, we've got feathers. I should research those, if we haven't already. I don't think we uh, have. already researched. Oh, nah, okay. That is sad life. Okay, I put the glass in the big chest. Thanking you, I'm going to start cooking. Fine, goo. Man, this game's so fun. I always forget, and then I don't play for months, and then I'm like, I wow, know. this game fucking rules. It's got, like, a really fun gameplay loop. Oh, that's too far. Whee! On fishing. Decoration. Sure. Women fear me. Fish want me. Firewood at rack and clock. Ooh. I can't cook a catfish, you asshole! How do you catch a catfish? How do I can't, make oh, big? um, I think we need a bigger grill. Yeah, Catfish we... are pretty big. I actually think we've got all of this. This is fine. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna do that. You are holding a channel cat. Meow. That is, um... I don't know if that's, like, the proper name or just the colloquial name. Uh, but back in Dunville, the mascot of Dunville, where I grew up, is the Mudcat. That's right! Yeah, because we had, uh, we're on the water, and mudcats. Mudcats. So, uh, yeah. Oh, nice grill. Uh, thanks, I'm just trying to grill. I miss grilling. God, God, that is huge. You're not even Big gonna, guy. like, you're not gonna, like, prepare the fish in any way before you cook it? All right. Nah, I'm fucking hungry. I want to eat that shit. You just plop the whole thing right on the grill. All right. Yeah, I'm just plopping my whole vibe on the grill. Where do we put vine goo? Big chest? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Big chest. Big chest. So grand total, unless you have glass on you, we have three. Yeah, and I have ten uh, sand, actually. Oh, shit, that's way more than I thought. Okay, yeah, no problem getting that glass then. Yeah. Well, um, I got metal ore. Oh, I've got no planks now. That's cool. That's fine. You know, we're starting to get a lot of ingots. We've got 10 ingots and I've got two ore here. We're getting a lot of metal to work with. <laughs> Just, but don't mind me barking like a dog as soon as I see a single thing that I need. I like Give that we're, I like that we're cooking with like wood planks in our grill. Oh, yeah. That makes I, perfect sense. I don't think dropping three little piddly <laughs> planks down there with no kindling whatsoever is going to create the kind of sustainable fire that is going to cook a catfish. Ah, uh, you sound a bit like a negative Nancy right now. 
cooked catfish a solid meal. Well, I'm close to starving, so maybe I should take a nibble. You can eat that. Yeah, you eat that. Ooh, uh, it's a multiple eating one. Yeah. I actually, uh, as soon as I collect this vine goo, oh no, I, yeah, as soon as I do that, I'm going to smelt two copper ingots, and then we're going to get a circuit board. I'm going to research that, and we're going to see what we can learn. Oop, fell in the water. Okay, uh, so, him. oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, shit, did that, did, is he dead? Yeah. Oh, oh is shit. He, is he, is he? He's dead, he's dead. Should I drop anchor? Yeah, so yeah, can yeah, butcher yeah. Harvest him, okay. harvest him. Yeah, okay, dropped anchor. I'm jumping in. Get him. <laughs> fuck, <in>. yeah. <laughs> Oh, he's sinking. I'm collecting. I don't care if I drown. <laughs> Get that meat. Okay, I got it. Eat that meat. I like that the anchor is just floating in the darkness. Oh, yeah. It's it's perfectly sensible. Okay, well, it cost us an anchor, but for the shark meat, it might be worth it. Yeah. We can cook, I think, three shark meat on the grill as well. Ooh. So as soon as the salmon's done, chuck them on. Can do. Yeah, I like there can do go. attitude. Check that out. My new strategy worked. When I reel in yes. the big things, while I'm reeling in the big thing, I turn around so I'm facing the raft so that if it overflows my inventory, I throw it all back onto our raft. Heck yeah. It's clever. It works. Yeah, it's the strats. It's, it's the, the strats. big brain strats. Wow, Madra, you're so big brained. Oh, fuck, I almost threw something in the water. Okay, no, we're good, we're good. Oh, whoo, okay, no, it's good. It's fine, it doesn't look good, <laughs> oh but it's God. good. We are playing with fire. Yeah, don't look over there, it's all fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this plastic is not in danger. <laughs> oh, I'm hungry, right, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you want this, Stop uh... rumbling. You want a catfish? I've only bitten into it a little bit. <laughs> nah, I got my salmon. Oh, delicious. Okay, that is a gigantic fucking salmon. Get out of I'm here. Hungry. I'm just a hungry Sweet. little guy. Uh, oh yeah, go um, for gold with the, um, with the schmeat, by the way. Ah! What did I drop? Uh, Decoration package! <gasps> I'm going for it! <sighs> Get it! <laughs> it's important. Oh, I got it! I need this vanity item! <laughs> I need my go. Gucci Prada. There we go. Oh, beautiful. It was worth it. It was all worth it. Oh, there's another raft over there. Man, okay, you, you want to know why this country is absolute balls? Uh, yeah. Okay, the reason this country is balls is my monitor is starting to go orangish right now. Now, part of it oh. is because it is sundown in game and you have the mood colors and whatever. But the mood colors for me, not for the audience, but for me, is way off. And the color is way off because flux is kicking in to make it a little bit more orange and give me a little bit less blue light. Why is it doing that at... 4.50 p.m., you would wonder. Oh, well, because the sun is already going down, because it's almost black outside, because welcome to Canada, where in the winter, you have, like, 10 minutes of daylight. That sucks. I live in legitimately one hour away from the most southern point in the entire country, and that is how long our winters are. <laughs> our winters have, like, no daylight. Anywhere farther north than me, which... Like, I think it's like 10% of Canadians live outside of the Golden Horseshoe or some bullshit like that. For them, it's darker for longer. It's weird living this far north. Uh, yeah. I guess you live Ooh, pretty okay. far south. I mean, yes, no one geographically lives really, really, really far south, unless you're like bottom tip of Argentina, I guess. But, yeah. uh... New Zealand's about as close as it gets. It's like that in Tasmania. Okay, we have a goal. Yep. Eight planks, six plastic, two circuit boards, one hinge for a receiver, four scrap, one circuit board, one bolt for an antenna, and we can start locating the big islands. We might have all of that. 
We just have to make the circuit boards. Yeah, I think that's it. You said we can make vine goo with like, was it leaves? It's um, uh, seaweed. Seaweed. Okay, that's a little, a little harder to get. Uh, I've got six of it, so we're okie dokie. Is that enough for all the vine goo we need? Uh, so we need three circuit boards. It might be. Is it like a one-to-one -one thing, like sand to glass? Uh, circuit board. Yes, yes. Okay. So I just need, oh, and copper ingots, but I've got 11 uh, copper, and we need two per circuit board, wow. we need six, which is fine. I'm happy that you have a lot of copper because I was finding like all iron or it says metal, but I'm assuming it's iron. Yes. Cause yeah. you know, what with it looking like iron and all. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, I would argue that that's fair. Yeah. Also, if we don't like the night cycle, we can um, skip it with beds. Oh, that's cool. I yeah. kind of like how it looks though. It's really pretty. It is really pretty. Uh, less so when your monitor is turning orange, um, yeah. because your your country is too far north and really should just like saw itself off and just paddle <laughs> paddle its way a little farther south. Like I know there's a country in the way, but like we can go around. The Atlantic's pretty big. Yeah, I mean, Personally, I, agree. I, 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 I get out of here. Like I I figure if we um get the fucking out of here. I feel like if we just saw off the country, right? At the, mm -hmm. at the American border, because it's where the property line is. Yeah. We paddle a little bit east, we paddle a little bit south, until Canada is, like, kind of middle of the Atlantic. Just mm -hmm. get rid of the ocean, just have, like, a continent right in the middle of it. And it would be, like, a really great trade hub between the Eastern world and the Western world. Personally, I think this would be a, a lucrative idea for Canada, and it would melt all of the permafrost so that we would have probably the most arable land for farmland of any country on earth, I can think of absolutely zero reasons why we don't just saw the country off and paddle it over a little bit. It seems like it would I solve a lot. Yeah, like if it we does. want Canada to be a great power, if we want to be able to produce the kind of food that can feed the world, then I think uh, we need to relocate. <laughs> Much like okay. how I need to move from this shitty country, Canada needs to move from this shitty location. <laughs> absolutely. I, you know what? Here, here. Um, thanks for coming to my TED talk. <laughs> You're welcome. Can you imagine? Thanks for coming to your TED talk, and one of the audience members just goes, "You're welcome." <laughs> I knew a guy who did a TED talk once. There's no fucking requirements for those things. He did a TEDx. That's cool. It is kind of cool, but also like I think you literally just like film it yourself on a stage and you send it into them and they will upload it. And the thing is like TEDx uploads something absurd, like hundreds of videos a day or some bullshit. And you can go on there and they all have three views and they have a rule where if like it gets enough views, then they'll, they'll give you a proper Ted talk. Hey, that's neat. I could yeah. do a Ted talk one day. I'm going to become a doctor of psychology. That would be pretty cool. I knew a chick who did a TED talk once. We recorded RAF together in 2023. I'm qualified for a TED talk. Everybody wants to know how to be a content creator now. I, I kind of hate that term, but it's better content than fucking- creator. I, I hate the term, but I will take content creator any day over influencer. Influencer, I, yep. I knew dude, exactly what you were gonna say. I hate being called an influencer. I get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. We're good. He bit the reinforced <laughs> one. Um, I, I will take that any day over being called it a fucking influencer. However, um, all the time, like sponsors will email or, or people emailing to like try and send you a game key or something and they'll call you a fucking influencer. It's the Awful. worst. I, I always, always like I'm polite, obviously, but I'll do a little PS in there where I just say like, Hey, just by the way, I, I prefer not to be called an influencer. All me and a lot of people who do this for a living are really uncomfortable with that term because it lumps us in in like pop culture knowledge. It lumps us in with like Instagram models and yes. and uh, people on TikTok and like pranksters and like all this other bullshit that we don't want to be associated with. Like, and, and this has a real life effect on YouTubers. I want to point out the f uh, one of the accountants that I almost got. 
um, claimed, like, you need to get an account who understands YouTube for it to work. Because my first account did not understand YouTube and cost us a lot of money. Um, so the, the second one that I almost got, because they claimed that they work with influencers and they claimed that they know, like, because I said, like, okay, you know, I, I do YouTube. Do you understand how YouTube pay works? Do you understand, like, how YouTube tax works? And they're like, yes, we work with influencers. And it's like, okay, talk to them slightly longer. And they are telling me that I need to start um, charging all of my Twitch subscribers HST to cover it for the government which is fucking stupid Yikes. and insane and obviously not true. And when I called the CRA to ask them for sure, the lady on the phone laughed because she knew what Twitch was and she laughed at the idea of having to charge your subscribers at HST. How would you even do that? That's impossible. And I, It would I, be I, impossible. Like, I literally even tried to explain to the accountant, I don't work in sales. I don't qualify for HST. And they just tried to get me to charge HST to subscribers. So, so yeah. Stupid. Yeah, and be, just because they... And they thought that they understood how it worked because they had worked with, like, some Instagram models who sold diet tea. And so they thought they understood how it worked because to them, influencer all means the same thing. This is one of the major practical reasons why YouTubers fucking hate being called influencers. Yep. This affects our lives. People are stupid. Yeah. Oh, it's brutal, man. Like, I understand that it's a really opaque job and people don't understand how it works. And that's why I try to just, you know, let people know how it works. But fuck, man. Sucks. Yeah, that's rough. That's yeah. rough. Yeah. It's not it's not even the end of the accounting issues either, because my current accountant who has worked with YouTubers and is much better, uh, I just got letters in the mail that are like, uh, explain this tax difference. And it's like, okay, well, I didn't file my taxes, my accountant did, so hey buddy, can you explain this difference? Yeah. You get all my transactions, brother. It wasn't me who filed the T4. I hope you can solve this in the next six days or else it's my ass on the line. And you know why it's, you know why I only have six days to respond? The letter was dated November 28th. It arrived to me, uh, what, December 12th or something? Hold on, oh what was yesterday? Yeah, the 12th, 12th of December is when it arrived because Canada Post is the worst mail courier service in the goddamn universe. And it's like, oh, uh, hey, you have 20 days to explain this difference. It's all good, just explain it. And it's like, it gives you no information in any way, shape, or form on how to explain it. Uh, are that's we, so annoying. Hold on, are we not moving? Oh, we may not be. We're not moving. Oh, cause cause the sail's going in the wrong direction. Oh, oh, we're fighting. Should we drop sail and just Oops. go to that island?